Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you from wherever you're watching from. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Extensive. All right, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to bring in your VMix to your Zoom meeting, and how to bring your Zoom meeting also to your VMix using the audio cable A plus B. So stay tuned in this video. Don't forget my name, Joseph Olazukwami, and this is Extensive. All Alright, so without wasting time, I'm just gonna go straight into it. So before we do that, we have to download the virtual audio cable A plus B. Virtual audio cable. I'm just gonna go to it. The virtual audio cable, you see the DVB audio cable app. So once you go into it, you're gonna download it. It's actually not free. Of course, it's not free. So you'll see a, let me say down here. Download virtual audio cable. This is the normal one VB. So we need A plus B. This is A plus B. So the A plus B, there's also C plus D down for Windows. Yep. And when you see it, you're just gonna I mean my network is kind of lagging. So yes, once it's loaded, just go into like I'm a fan. So five dollar five euros right there. At least five euros. If you want to you know donate more to them, you can use the 10 euros, 15, 20, 25. So the five euros then add to cards after you add to cards you're gonna ask to um you're gonna be asked to create an account i guess then you proceed to check out then you're gonna you know ask to pay the five dollars how much are you paid this and that and that you agree and once you put the check out you pay for the money but i already have it actually so i'm no need to pay it since i've already done that it's on one of my friend actually one of my subscribers sent it to me for free so I really appreciate the person. Thank you so much for sharing for me. All right. So because of this, um, I think I'm not sure. So I think I want to share this um audio cable A plus B to my subscribers also to anyone that watched this video. The VB A plus B for free. I don't know. Check it in the description below. If you see it there, it means I changed my mind and I shared it to you. And if you did not see it there, then probably I changed my mind and I didn't want to share it with you all. So just check the description link in this video and see if there's a tool of virtual audio cable A plus B. All right, so you're gonna see the virtual audio cable A driver, the B driver. So once you extract it, you know, most of it for you're gonna more options, extract the video, if you be audio cable. So once you decide both of them, I have it here. This is A. So once you enter the A, you're gonna see the whole list of this. Then all you have to do is run the setup then says the four or administrator and yep then you'll see it's already installed actually we the cable a is already installed if you have not installed it just click on install here not remove drivers then do the same for your virtual audio cable b also this will be on on top of it you do the same for virtual the cable b and then you install both of them so once you install it you have to restart your system to you know get it working and after that is done this is it over here so in your vmix one thing i'm gonna do let me first import something i want to send right from my vmix to my zoom meeting so let's see if there's a video okay there's a video there's a promo video okay i think let me just use this Sony solar live all right so this is the video right all right so i'm not gonna play it yet then i want to do something also go to your settings over here and then you go to your audio output your audio output that is for the outing right now I want to send from the vmix tools and any software audio output go to your a this bus a we have bus a b c d e f g so in your bus a you click on it and you select the vb input a this is it over here you know i have the vb virtual cable i have the vb a and the vbb so this is a click on the virtual audio cable input vb audio cable a then you click ok and vmix will ask you to restart your vmix right so i'm going to off the internet connection if you understand you understand so i'm going to off the internet connection and restart to make changes right so once that is being done okay so after doing the bus a stuff and vmix just go to your add input let me add this microphone in it so we we'll have the audio input and we have our microphone right this is the usb pmp sound device it's kind of clashing because you know it's connected to what i'm using so let me just off the sound all right so i've off the sound then whatever that's going on can be going on so this is my audio right here right so we have the boss if you notice anything you add to it now 
do be let me just put the minus 12 db as usual i should be so anything you have here you see the bus a which is beside it and all your audio inputs or any input you after as an audio all right so clicking the a means you are sending it to a also am i correct clicking the a means you are sending it to a so in your zoom if you go to the settings more let's go to settings all right where is settings okay so this settings for you your zoom go to your settings let me just do all this then we go to our audio then in the audio microphone okay that is, is that the setting in the audio microphone you make sure it's in virtual audio cable a output a so the more i'm talking it's coming from this vmix right see it's setting over here and the more it's coming in here if i to off the bus a nothing is gonna come in you see nothing's gonna come in until you on the bus a then things are coming in so anything you have bus a as many as it is it's gonna be going in your zoom that is one step going right so now from your zoom those that are talking if you want them to be like to, to to be shown like for example you are doing is show which uh, people are talking on them so you are doing like a google meeting a zoom meeting i want to live stream it also so to so bring from your zoom which is your speaker to a vmix this is what i'm gonna do it so in your speakers now the other cable set it in cable b input that is the vb audio cable b virtual audio cable b so once that is connected we're not going to test it yet because we're here to add it so go to your add input over here in the mix we're going to go to audio input then we're going to add the vb audio cable b so from the speaker here it's going out coming in in your vmix and from the vmix here is going out through the a coming in as a microphone in your zoom do you get it up i hope you get it all right so this is a very okay will be if you press okay i cannot see it over here this is his virtual key will be so i'm going to test speaker right now whatsoever is playing is going to sound here this is now see it's sounding right that is sending the speaker so if i want to on let me off the audio and just on this stuff and i'm gonna hear it So that is the audio being you know testing that testing the speakers so whatever you are doing this is how you test it to no no uh, your microphone is ringing and your speakers are also is also ringing so if you can use the um just reduce the volume in case if it case it's too much why we like to increase it so that yeah i can just reduce it for me if i want to press okay it's saved already then in your audio cable so we can just reduce the volume a little bit here yeah, yeah that way i think it's preferable so, so one thing i also used to do is because you know if you are sending your audio now from this audio one is on to add my camera and let me say you can let me add a cam for example i'm taking this now for my hd cam of the audio none so i'm taking this camera now to zoom right i'm taking this camera to zoom okay let's put it this way i'm taking this camera to zoom and i'm also taking my audio which is here to zoom i just put the camera here i'm taking this audio to zoom this is my audio from zoom this is my audio from zoom this is my audio to zoom right there so taking this camera to zoom which is gonna go there right am i correct then the audio also is going what i'm trying to explain is that if i'm taking this camera to zoom and the audio is also going i don't want to be hearing myself because when i'm talking right it's coming also from zoom to to the vmix so i don't want it to be like you know echoing in the way in my ear i don't want to hear myself so you can also go to your audio input tool and you can just mute the earphone over here you can mute the earphone so you will not hear yourself but it's also sending to zoom you can just test the audio all right so it's still sending to zoom look at it over here, the microphone right but you're not going to be able to hear yourself so it's not like you're not hearing yourself as it's coming in then you know because in case you're testing it with your microphone you're testing it with like a earphone and stuff you're going to be hearing yourself which can be would i say tricking you or kind of kind of confusing you in a way so just off the microphone there and you're still hearing your audio it's your audio is coming in look at over here but that way you won't be hearing yourself so you're just missing your stuff from here and that is how you bring your zoom to vmix if vmix to zoom okay so if you want to bring also the video let's test it right now so we're going to no medicine right so mainly what i use this to do is to like live stream for churches we want to so we used to have a zoom meeting like some virtual churches now for example and what i do is not doing all this what i do is just live streaming like they have this of program to face the praise and worship before the ministration before some things so the praise and worship are live streaming for them like you know for them to see it also in zoom and for them to see it on facebook so i'm live streaming for them this is the video here 
you know above my audio from yeah this is like a o like your old prison worship section so live streaming this for them i'm also live streaming to zoom and to facebook and stuff i'm not going to that right now so what we're going to do is this audio also we take it to zoom that is from the a they will take the video also to zoom present the external right so now in your video here press this your video use the vmix audio vmix video rather then we on it what i'm saying is this what is going on over here then the audio also we can on it then everything is all set your microphone from here right from here is coming in then from your speakers is going into your zoom it's going into your zoomic so people are hearing the present worship session that is going on after the present worship session that is going on if maybe for example people are dancing and you want to show the dancing stuff people are also going to be you know divided here divided here divided divided here people that are also joining the participants they have already seen everything coming back to vmix if you are going to bring in your zoom meetings over here you want to bring your add inputs bring what is going on in zoom go to your ndi i okay, want to go to zoom look at the top actually this is the zoom meeting i think two or one okay so i think it's the two the zoom meeting Yes, this is it over here. So this is what is going on in the Zoom, right? This is me over here. This is what is going on in the Zoom, and this is me. What is going on in the VMix? So I'm giving them, and they're giving me back. So what is going on is that the way I will do it is that I'm not going to show. I'm going to hide. There's a way you can hide the participant when you are. There's a way to hide yourself as that when you are um, hosting the Zoom call, right? So you're just going to add hide yourself through the view stuff that people that are showing just hide the host this way is an right cell view rather so this is the cell view enabled until there's another video to display so the more people add there if one person just one person can add they're not going to see yourself then everything is just said there whatever you're doing here is there and you're not going to see yourself so what you're displaying is not yourself what you're displaying is people that are also live but they, they are also saying this and your audio is coming into vmix that is just as how it is i hope this is really helpful for you so i can also put in a picture in picture you know how picture in picture works right you can put in a picture in picture if you have any picture sets excuse me you can, i can just add a blank or do in brief right you can add a blank or is blank yes can a blank then i can just put in go to the settings go to layer multi view go to number one should be the what i'm like showing from here why number two should be like a desktop capture the picture in picture what is going on so just because i'm here that's why if no one is also here you will see it and it's going to be making a lot more sense so we can just put in like a picture in picture this is one and two right so one and two is here if you have a lot of people three four can put it here one two then the third person we here the fourth person we here we have five six seven eight nine you know lots of people like that so for now it's just you know, what is going on in your zoom and what is going on on the live stream so i can be showing what is going on like you know let me explain to you more if this is going like they put it live right now we're going to off because there's nothing that is going on you get you get you get that kind of thing so just for instance i'm going to use this one to explain to you just when you are going on live now this is what you are live streaming right and this is people that are reacting to the video on zoom so i can bring that in you remember i've had myself so this is not showing it's other people so i can just bring it in showing other people that are dancing to it other people that are worshiping in spirit to it and that is how you live stream it to any of your choice your social media facebook youtube and any other social media i really hope this is helpful to you so thank you very much for watching uh if you have any comments you can comment it right now i'm gonna help you as best as i can you try to comment as fast as possible thank you very much stay tuned don't forget my name joseph olaskomi and this is extensivo follow me on facebook i'm on facebook right now extensivo is a page i'm also on whatsapp message me on whatsapp everything is in the link description of this video the link is there so stay tuned don't forget my name again joseph olaskomi and this is extensivo sorry if this video is kind of fast for you because i know i speak fast if it's fast for you just go to your settings in your youtube video and reduce the playback speed to 0.5 i really hope it's not that fast all right so thank you again once again i think i said thank you three times i'm gonna stop talking right now